At least one business in the metro is changing how it operates. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Brad Stevens. And I'm Carolyn Long. Ray's Cafe in Blue Springs is now a private club, not a public restaurant. The owner is asking for a one-time, one-dollar membership fee to join her mask-free cafe. Now, there are different rules for private and public businesses. Our Abby Dodge looked into whether there's some legal ground here for such a change. She joins us live now from the cafe. Abby, I'm wondering if this is something we might see other businesses trying to do. Well, Carolyn, right now, Ray's Cafe is the only private club we know of established during the pandemic. But there are still some questions in the legal community about whether or not this is actually going to work. Ray's Cafe has plenty of support from locals willing to stand out on the sidewalk with signs promoting the decision. The county's closing notice on the front door is covered up by the change. Dollar membership fee. Ray's went from public to private overnight. And so the question would be, is it really? The most recent Jackson County mask order spells out the possible loophole. Mask guidelines apply to places of public accommodation, not including private clubs. UMKC professor Alan Rostron says loopholes like this one tend not to stand up in court. So there's a little bit of uh, precedent out there about the distinction between a public business and a private club, but I think it is new as to COVID. There's some pending litigation going on right now here in Jackson County. The attorney general is involved, so we reached out to his office again today to see if he's going to get personally involved in this situation here at Ray's Cafe. We're waiting to hear back his answer. Live in Blue Springs, Abby Dodge, KC, TV5 News. Yeah, curious to see what happens next. Abby, thank you.